So for this vehicle, you're going to need a uh, plastic pan removal tool like this one. Uh, it's basically non-marring, so it's less likely to scratch your dash when, when pulling trim pieces out. I'll have a link in the description area below. And you'll also need a Phillips uh, head screwdriver or a 8mm uh, socket. So this dash piece is simple in its construction, but it was really difficult to remove. Uh, it's just clips behind it but I had to use a lot of pressure here. Uh, when you grab this uh, panel, try to pull from the meteor side like I am right here. Try not to pull from the top silver thin piece that's very uh, on the very, very top of it. Um, after you get one side kind of loose, head to the other side in the corner and just kind of work your way around and just relieve some of the pressure off of the points. It takes a little while. It took me about seven minutes of doing this to get to release and then when I did pull it out it almost flew out, my, flew out of my hands as you'll see here but definitely do not try this with a flat blade screwdriver make sure you have a non-marring tool and grab the meaty sides I just want to show here in real time so you guys have an idea how difficult it was uh, next, you'll have four bolts, two on each side of the stereo. Use a 8mm, I believe, or a Phillips screwdriver. Whatever you do, don't drop these in the dash. You'll never see them again. And here I am using my Phillips screwdriver because uh, on that side, I couldn't get my gun into it. So uh, it was kind of a tight clearance, so I used my Phillips screwdriver instead. And the bolts were not difficult to release. Put a blanket down below the stereo and put it up high. That way you can rest the stereo on top of it. You won't scratch anything. Plus, it gives you a little area to rest the stereo on while you remove the connectors. Uh, this center connector, the tab is actually on the side of the connector, not on the top. So you have to remove the one next to it. And then you can remove that middle one. And those two main power plugs are your uh, main stereo uh, harnesses. And this is the back of this stereo, just in case you guys wanted to see that. And thanks for watching, and make sure to like the video.